It's time to review February's numbers. I've got one word to describe this month. Plateau. So I do these monthly weigh-ins, monthly check-ins, progress report things, because I want to show you how numbers, my numbers at least, fluctuate, how my you know weight tracks and that kind of thing. And my process is always to, you know, make goals at the beginning of the month, you know, try my best to stay on plan. And then at the end of the month, look back and say, you know, did it work? Did it not? What happened? So in January, I had a really good month. You know, I lost like three pounds, which was more than what I was planning on. And uh, for this month, I wanted to lose two more. And really, you know, there weren't many challenges uh, for this month that I could foresee. I knew that we had Valentine's Day slash uh, our anniversary, uh, which I knew would be a day where I would be off. And I had a couple of lunches that I knew would happen. So those days I would be, you know, off plan. At least I would be, you know, just eating lunch and supper. So one thing that happened at the beginning of this month, which I did not foresee, was we all got really bad colds. And that was like the first two weeks was just interrupted sleep, people coughing, you know, uh, me having to you know, be up with kids and stuff. So it was, you know, bad sleep the first two weeks. And then also in the last week of February, that was one of the most stressful weeks I've had in recent memory. So there were there were no real big, you know, as far as eating plan, I feel like I stayed on plan. I did not cave into any stress eating, which I'm really proud of myself for. But let's look at the numbers because that's really uh, the more interesting part. So I did walk at least 14,000 steps every single day. My total for the month of February was 434,847, and that's a total of 187.58 miles. So now let's talk about my weight. I ended January at 154.86, but I ended February at 155.03. So that's a total gain of 0.17 pounds. So basically, I was at a plateau for the month of February. So my highest single day weight was 158, my lowest single day weight was 153.2. And the most that my weight fluctuated within one week was 4.8 pounds. So when I hit a plateau, I always do try to say to myself, first, did I stick to the plan? It, you know, did I not walk like I'm supposed to or was I not eating like I was supposed to? If those answers are an honest, yeah, I really did stick to the plan then I tell myself, okay, just give it more time. And sometimes it takes the scale a few weeks to really catch up to what I've been doing. At least that's my experience. And so that's what I'm going to keep doing. I'm not going to change the plan. I'm just going to keep eating once a day, cheat day on Sunday, walking six miles a day. And if it comes to a point where I realize, wow, I cannot lose any more on this current plan, I'm going to have a decision to make. And that's either going to be I'm going to continue on the plan and just maintain, or, you know, maybe I'll change something really small and see if I can get the scale to move again. But for now, I'm keeping everything the same and we'll see what happens in next month's weigh-in. So how was your February? I wonder, you know, February is kind of a challenging month. A lot of times if you've set some weight loss goals up, uh, at the beginning of the year, you know, by February, a lot of people kind of fall off the wagon. So how was your February? And if it was good, let me know in the comments below. If it was bad, let me know. So thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below.